In this video we're going to manage groups. We're on the home page at the moment. We're going to the contacts page and then we're going to the groups tab. Now what we're going to do now is we're going to learn how to create a group. We're going to learn how to, uh, which is here, we're going to learn how to change a group which you can get to by clicking on this link. We're going to learn how to merge two groups and we're going to learn how to delete a group. Now you should note that when you delete a group you've got options as to whether you delete the included members or not and we're going to be careful not to delete the included members. Right, let's create a group. Let's create a group called Test1. We've created that group, but how would we know? Let's go and have a look here. Could we have to use the filter to find out if we've created anything? So it looks as if we've created a group. There's no contacts in it. Let's create another group, test two. Okay, because we've got the filter in place, that's just appeared immediately. Now we're going to alter it. Now that uh, we're going to alter it or amend it, that means click on this link and into edit group contacts. Now just before I do that, I just want to point out here's a delete group option as well and here's a delete group and contacts. You don't want to use this unless you're really confident about what you're doing. So we're going to edit group contacts now and here we have all the contacts that are possible uh, but we need to filter out that and what I'm going to do is create a, two groups um, I'm going to be in both of them, Heather's going to be in one of them, and Karina's going to be in the other one. So this one will add Heather, that's Heather Williams, and she appears there. Notice there's no commit button here, it just works by magic, this one. And that's Jeremy Bush who is there, so we're done. We go back to look at the group you can see that there we are okay now let's go hit this uh, tab again and we get back to the original situation here's test two uh, if we didn't um, have this filter in place this wouldn't be so easy you see if I take the filter out there's all the groups coming back and I have to actually go and find test two so test two is there we click on this link in order to get to the amend facility or the edit facility and then we click on we could change this to let's change the name of this that's big letters All right um, we're going to edit the group oh, we're going to save the changes like that my group has been updated now we're going to edit the contacts and this one is going to be Karina Karina Denning and me again. Oops, what did I do there? So that's Karina and me. Back to test two. There we are. Great. I'll go back to the original groups list. There's the two things and they're there because the filter is set. I'm going to group, merge some groups now. Just because this because there's test 1 and test 2 it doesn't know that, they, that I'm going to merge those until I get to here. I'm going to merge it into a new group called Merge Test. And I'm going to the groups that I'm going to add. Uh, I have to know both contain test. See how the filter works? Pretty cool. And then I'm going to confirm. So here's my oops. Here's my merged test group, and you can see the three people there, and you can see that I'm only in it once. 
even though I was in both of the original groups. So it remains for us just to delete these groups in order to complete the tutorial. So am I going to do delete group and contacts? No, I'm not. I'm going to do delete the group. Yep, I'm sure. Now, I can see that uh, I've still got this filter in place and now I can delete this group and I can delete this group. So that's all the groups that uh, we created have now been deleted. Did I delete the people? Well, I didn't. obviously didn't delete Jeremy. Let me see if I deleted Karina. Nope. Did I delete Hannah? Oops, that's not how you spell. Hannah. Nope, she's still there. Okay, so you can delete groups without deleting the contacts that are in those groups. Important. Okay, thanks for watching.